This is the Dell Latitude 3190 2-in-1 laptop. It comes with a power cord, and we call it a 2-in-1 laptop because it is not only a laptop, but it can also convert into a tablet. Here it is in laptop mode. You simply fold the screen backwards and it can exist in tablet mode, flat or with the screen elevated. Or you can also flip it around into tent mode. Now let's put it back into laptop mode. The Dell Latitude 3192-in-1 laptop is made with a sealed spill-resistant keyboard and the touch screen is made from Corning Gorilla Glass. It is meant to be durable and user-friendly for students. Now let's take a look at the power buttons and the slots. On the right side of the device, you will see the microphone headphone jack, you will see the power button, you will see a volume up and down button, and you will see a rectangular slot that can be used for a cable locking device if it was necessary to lock the device to a stationary object. On the left side of the device, you will see a slot for the power cord, an HDMI slot, and two USB slots. To turn on the power, press the power button gently. It might take a few moments for it to start up completely. Be patient. The first question asks you to get started with a region. It wants to know if the region highlighted is the correct region. In this image, United States is highlighted, so the user should click yes in the bottom right hand corner. The next question asks, is this the right keyboard layout? Choose US and click the yes button in the bottom right hand corner. The third question asks you if you want to add a second keyboard layout. Click the skip button. Now it will ask you to connect to a network. Choose your home network from the list and enter your network password, then click OK. Now click Next. It will now go through some important steps to complete the setup. When the Windows 10 license agreement appears on the screen, you need to read through the agreement and then click Accept. The next question says, how would you like to set up? Choose the Setup for an Organization option and then click Next. Now you will sign in with your morestudents.com email account and click Next. It will take you to the Federation moreschools.com page, sign in using your morestudents.com account and your password. The next question wants to know if you want to do more across devices with activity history. Select no. Now it wants you to choose the privacy settings for your device. You do not need to turn on or off any options because we set those through the technology office. Simply click Accept. It will take several minutes for it to complete the setup process. When you see the login screen appear, the setup process is complete. You can log in with your morestudents.com account. Please leave the device on for a couple of hours so that all of the apps and all of the updates can install. Make sure you leave the laptop open during this process.